Hello friends, today in this video, I'll show you how you can integrate Gmail calendars in Outlook. As you know, we don't waste time. And uh, my all videos are quick and to the point. We don't waste time in talking here and there. So let's get started. First of all, we need to go to our Gmail Google account. And uh, in Google account, we need to go our calendars. So, if you do not know the exact URL of calendar, you just search in Google Calendar and you will see the first link is the link that we need to go. Click it. And here you can see your calendar. This calendar is really empty, nothing is there. So, I will create it. But first of all, we need to get an access uh, URL to enter and in enter in outlook so that it can fetch the content of this calendar in outlook automatically okay now what we have to do just you can see my calendars click the drop down menu and go settings and under the settings uh, in my calendar section you can see uh, your calendars here and I'm going to click this. As soon as I click, I can see the details of my calendars. And to calendar name and uh, description etc. is not there. That's no problem. And we are not also concerning about the description here in this video. We just need to move here and look for private address. Right. This is the section we need to, to grab the URL. And there are two things here. XML and iCal iCal is the link that we need to click it and as soon as you click it you will get a URL that you need to copy okay remember don't uh, click this link we just want to copy that's control C and now press okay okay we are done with the web interface we now can move to Outlook and create a calendar account here okay go to tools account settings and account settings click in internet calendars okay and click new because this is a new calendar we are creating here and control V to paste the URL that we just grabbed from the Google's calendar account and click add <coughs> okay it's asking me to supply a name that's good we'll give a name it's gmail Sorry. description if you want to give a description and you may be having multiple calendars then you need to specify your correct name I just uh, gmail okay and uh, if you want to download attachment attached to your gmail google's calendar you can check this box and uh, click ok we are done. Just close it and your internet calendar will appear here and here. Just click this and uh, currently there is no nothing. So we'll, what we will do, we will go and click on send receive all. It will also receive internet collection subscriptions details. See my calendars. Okay guys, we just uh, created uh, uh, our Gmail, uh, Gmail calendar in Outlook and if you see, uh, just go from your mail to calendar and you don't see the calendar listed here and the name you just specify, we just specify, I think uh, it's uh, Gmail for calendar, this is the uh, name of the calendar we just created in Outlook and if you don't see, actually it's hidden in the other calendars. If you click this drop arrow here, you will see it. And it's unchecked, so check it so you can see what's uh, going on in your Gmail calendar. Okay, let's uh, make an entry so we can see how it's synchronizing. Uh, today is uh, 25th, so I'm just uh, creating this video. So I'm typing creating this video. For YouTube, okay. I just make an entry here and create an event. So now go to Outlook, click on Send and Receive. Oh, okay. 
is receiving the content from Gmail calendar and you can see the time okay at this time it's uh, 7 oh I may can train mm, wrong time actually it's uh, 10 to 10 30 so I will drag it over here and now I again have to refresh it so we'll just do it so, okay send any symbol okay it's receiving now the time changed and you can see how it's synchronizing the calendar details and you can see whatever you got uh, if I create something here I create a task so I will ta create a task here So this way you can create uh, your and uh, synchronize uh, Google Calendar in your Outlook which is really very easy. I hope you liked the video. Please do subscribe for more videos on Outlook. Thank you.